So currently I am en route to a 64-man tournament for Beyblade. Honestly, I'm pretty stoked for this because i actually never been in a tournament as big as a 64 uh, participant tournament so it's probably gonna be wild and i'm really just hoping that i get to meet a lot of great people and have some uh, amazing battles so let's go ahead and uh, head over there Hey, what's going on guys? So I'm over here at the Jolly Toy Store for a B4 tournament. This is over in the Ahime Prefecture, which is like three and a half hour drive. So I drove a very, very long way to come and participate in this tournament. I'm hoping I can at least get past the first round, uh, but obviously the end goal is to win or at least place the top three. So um, I'm not gonna record the entire thing, but I'll go ahead and just like record some snapshots of the entire tournament. So hope you all enjoy. <laughs> ドラパパ変な負け方したら動画になるっすよ。マジかよ。マジかよ。マジかよ。マジかよ。マジかよ。マジかよ。マジかよ。マジかよ。マジかよ。マジかよ。マジかよ。マジかよ。マジかよ。
that first round with me bursting and him getting, uh, well, I'm getting a uh, extreme finish, they counted the burst finish. So, I don't know. I guess that's the rules. Um, it is what it is. But, yeah, I did my best. Uh, tried what I could. And, um, yeah, keep on grinding. Do it again next time. あ、なんか結構逃げたな。すごい結構逃げたそうだ。やっぱ点数の絶対。あ、すごいのは。え、もうサボさんさん。このタイミングで味方されることはないか。<笑><笑><笑><笑><笑> Let me explain. The match that I did was fantastic. I really love my opponent. I love the energy, the hype. It was amazing. I really enjoyed it. I enjoyed doing the practice rounds, constantly just grinding. But man, I really don't like losing as probably anyone else doesn't really like it. 
Now that doesn't mean that I actually want to always win. That's not the case. You see, I practiced and practiced and I was really just trying to make the perfect strategy. Go in there and just take it slow and steady. You know, let the recoil do its work. Not really be too aggressive in the beginning and obviously when we get to the semifinals and the quarterfinals, when we have to use our three deck, uh, you know, the entirety of our bays, then I can actually start pulling out the more aggressive plays. But that just didn't work. As you see in the video, it, I, I don't know what happened, but my bay just got stuck in the little, little tiny crack. You see this little thing right here, it got stuck in that tiny little crevice. I really feel like I had the better percentage chance of winning. And the first round, getting that burst, that was miserable. And then I got the second round, extreme finish. That was it. That was exactly what I've been practicing for. I kept getting consistency with that actual strat. In the angle that I launch, in the position that I launch, I kept getting a lot of either over finishes or extreme finishes on my opponent. But I got hit and I got pushed into that little tiny crevice. And I don't, think, yeah, that could be a strategy, but I think that's just a big fault of the base stadium. That shouldn't be a feature of the stadium that you can potentially get caught in a little tiny crack. I, they really need to make these bay stadiums a little bit better so that way something like that doesn't really hinder the entire performance because my bay is just losing stamina. It's just sitting in that crevice, losing all of his stamina. My opponent's sitting in the middle on his, on his ball bit, and I'm just, what can I do? But in total, guys, it was a fantastic time. Um, I, I had to leave a little bit early, so there's no footage of the actual quarterfinals, semifinals, and finals. Uh, it was really late. It was a three and a half hour drive. So I didn't really want to be driving around close to 11, 8 or 11 p.m. at midnight. So I did bounce a little bit early just so that way I can make it at home. I made it home by 10, so that's a good time frame. But anything later, I, yeah, it would have been pretty rough. So um, unfortunately, I don't have that footage. But congratulations to all those who you know, competed. Congrats to the finalist and congrats to the winner. Um, I probably will be doing another B4 tournament mid-January over in Okinawa if I do actually go to Okinawa for this class. Um, otherwise, I will be trying to go in February uh, to a couple of tournaments over there. Uh, but either way, that's it for me, guys. Thank you all for watching, and I'll be seeing you in the next video. Bye-bye. <laughs> Say hello. <laughs> Say hello. See you. YouTube. Oh, wow. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs>